Okay, welcome back. Now we are down to our plate number 8. So same thing from our previous plate. We will be using the circle, the offset, and trim command. So in this figure, we have a rectangle figure with um, semicircles and another hollow portion here. So let's start with this rectangular figure with a width of 2.5 and a length of 4.5. So let's go to our AutoCAD. Starting with your line command, set your first point. 4.5, enter. Going up, we have 2.5. And again, 4.5. And then just close your finger. So there we have our rectangular figure. Then let's offset this one to 1 1.5. Ah. Offset. Enter 1.5. Let's have it here and another here. And then let's offset this one to 0 0.5. Same with this one. Offset. There. So let's trim this part. So PR, double enter. We have this. Um, let's trim this one. Ah, this can just be deleted. Trim, 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 trim. This. We don't want to. Um, miss this portions still have to trim this part as well okay so we have this part already now let's proceed to this one this semicircular part so we have a radius of one 1 1.0 1 so let's offset this one let's determine our center so we have offset so we have to put this in the middle so you can type 2.25 half of your 4.5 you can do that you can also um, do another thing I just showed you the offset you can also copy this one so you want to move it here just like that so it actually indicates the midpoint of this line. So those are the two ways you can do that. So let's proceed to uh, drawing our circle again. We have the radius. Now we know the center of this one. So let's just, let me zoom out. Let's have one as a radius. So let's trim. Now we have this part. The next thing that we have to do now is the lower part, this one. So we know that it, we added like a 0.5 on it. So I will try another way to draw a circle. So this one, let's offset this to um, 1.5 and this one to 1.5 as well. So this is 0.5 distance here. So in this case, we have two points to draw this um, semicircle. So we have options here. We have a two point and a three point. So in this case, I'll be using two point. So we draw this one. So we have the second semicircle. So this time, let's trim the upper portion. And we have that. Let's trim this one as well. This one. This one, this one, oh, no. let's just delete that one. Let's delete this construction lines that we have. Then trim again. Um, let's trim this. And this one, I didn't del wasn't able to delete this one properly. Delete, then trim. Let's trim this one. And there you have our figure. Now let's proceed to our dimensions. So we have that. Let's put our dimensions now. 
like the dimensions or you can just type D to um, activate the command we have 1.5 here we also have another 1.5 here let's just um, do that so you can see the importance of activating your object snap so you can easily do this one uh, half of this how to do that this one you can use this as your reference point so if you see this triangle that's the midpoint then you could just do this and we have also have the distance for this one and the distance for this one you can actually extend it okay and now let's have the radius doesn't look nice let's have this one let's do the same um, I'll use the different thing, um, positioning there so we have your plate number 8 so you know what to do 